In this video, American hunter Josh Bomar gives a multi-angle look at his Alberta hunting trip, complete with soundtrack. When a bear is lured to the area with food, this former javelin competitor launches a spear, impaling the bear. The animal runs off. Bomar's celebration begins. He later finds the spear. It is a lot of penetration, and you can see it is a big, big blade. The next day, he finds the dead bear. The video was uploaded online, and the backlash was swift. Some even comparing it to the uproar after an American dentist killed the beloved African lion, Cecil. There's some things you just don't, uh, or probably shouldn't, post on, on YouTube. But it's not just those against hunting voicing their opposition, but fellow hunters too, saying that spear hunting is inhumane because it could take longer for the animal to die. With a high-powered rifle, one's able to place the bullet very precisely, exactly where it's going to kill the animal quickly. And that's always the hunter's objective. Bomar says he spent years preparing and practicing his technique, but those who teach hunting safety courses say they don't condone it. The gentleman putting himself in that situation, standing on the ground with no protection, with a wild carnivore standing there at a bait pile, is not a safe thing to do. And soon it won't be legal either. The government says this fall it will introduce a ban on spear hunting. Even though it isn't prohibited now, Fish and Wildlife has launched an investigation into the case. We looked to ensure that the wildlife was hunted within the open season. Uh, the, the person was licensed appropriately. Bomar billed his detailed play-by-play -play as epic. No doubt it's been seen around the world, and now investigators will be taking a closer look. Briar Stewart, CBC News, Edmonton.